Okay, let's say you've created a new track and you've chosen if it's a stereo or mono track. You've already named it. We'll go ahead and name this one Vocal 1. And now that we got the track uh, up, let's say we've already recorded a vocal and now we want to adjust the volume. Usually you just click it and you drag it to where you think the volume sounds the best. And in this case, we want to get a precise number. So what we're going to also do is press the command while clicking on the fader. And this is going to allow us to drag it to a precise number, which we weren't able to do before. If you do command click on this little black box, it'll bring up the delay, then the peak, and then back to volume. That's a mistake I always make. So first click, then hit the command button. Then you'll be able to move to whatever number you want. Okay, now let's say that you have a vocal take and you want to add a reverb. If you just go to the sends and you hit new track, uh, this prompt comes up. You name it whatever you want. We're going to call this one verb. And it's going to pre-route everything for me. Okay, the, the verb track, auxiliary, it's already made. The verb is already routed into the input of the auxiliary. And we have the verb send. If you hit option on that, it'll send that fader to zero. And then again, if you click on command uh, and you move it, you get that precision we've been talking about this whole time. Yeah, I hope you guys can use these uh, tips, and thank you again for the 1,000 subscribers. I really appreciate it. hope you guys are safe and sound. Take care.